Good morning, Yarna Bees. How are you today? Today is another episode of the 25 Days of Blissmas that I'm doing with Rosalie at Yarn It Out. I am so tired. Oh my goodness. I stayed up until 3.30 in the morning last, last night because my daughter was driving back down from the north and uh, she's coming home for Christmas, hopefully, and the roads were treacherous absolutely treacherous and with the main road being washed out um, they had to take the old road the old highway and it was just it was nasty and I was so worried about her but she did make it home so uh, so I ended up taking something to help me sleep and I slept and now it's like 12 o'clock in the afternoon <laughs> so yeah I'm a little late Chai tea. Oh, mmm. So today is Sunday. George is home. He's watching football. He's going to be making noises. Say hello. <laughs> so, yes. Okay. Shall we get into it? Houston, we have a problem. Hello? 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 Um. Okay. So, um. <laughs> yeah. Uh. I think Rosalie may have miscalculated <laughs> or something. Um, okay, I'll just, I'll sit here and drink my tea. <laughs> okay. Um, so <clears throat> we have a week now no gifts <laughs> hmm all right then um so i guess this is the end of my blissmas <laughs> blissmas comes early blissmas, blissmas comes early yes uh okay um well let's do our question were you naughty? I, I guess I was naughty. I didn't, I was so naughty I didn't even get a lump of coal. <laughs> okay, um, uh, what, what question? Oh, the question for yesterday was the Muppet Christmas Carol who played, who played Scrooge. Hint, it wasn't a Muppet. It wasn't a Muppet? No. Let's see if George knows this. I honestly don't know. The Muppet Christmas Carol. Who played Scrooge? Uh, I won't do it. Wow, George doesn't know this one. The answer was Michael Caine. Well, how about that? <laughs> we stumped George. <laughs> that doesn't happen very often. Okay, but most of you got it right. <laughs> okay, today's question. As the clock chimes midnight to ring in the new year, the Spanish tradition involves eating 12 of what? You're supposed to have one of each chime, a one, at, of one for each chime. 
you know what I'm going to do? I'm, I've, got, I've got all these questions to the 25th. And um, no vi videos to, <laughs> to do these. So I, I'm going to, okay. Are you going to answer all, ask all the questions? Come here, come closer so people can hear you. I want right. to see if you know the question, the answers to these. I don't know the answer to the one you just asked. Okay. Oh, okay. So as the clock chimes midnight to ring in the new year, the Span a Spanish tradition involves eating 12 of what? You're supposed to have one of them for each chime. Let's see if you guys know the answer. Um, but I don't know the answer. You don't know? No. Oh my God, we stumped him twice. I'm not Spanish and I don't do Muppets. <laughs> I don't even know the Spanish Muppets. <laughs> Kermit Le Frog. Kermit Le Frog, that's French. Or, or whatever, you know. <laughs> okay, um, so the answer to that one is grapes. Wow. Yeah. No idea. Who invented... Uh, who invented electric Christmas lights? Well, Edison invented the light bulb. We're on a roll, you guys. So Edison invented the light bulb. When? When did he? When did he invent the light bulb? No. When did he invent invent Christmas lights? Um, at Christmas time. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. So it was Thomas Edison in 1880. So I got that one right. <laughs> you got half of it right. <laughs> uh, what much relieved Christmas edible is known for its long shelf life? Oh, I hate this stuff. <laughs> oh, is that that head cheese or whatever? No. Christmas cake. Fruit cake. Fruit cake, yeah. <laughs> that stuff is horrible. Ugh. What Christmas decoration was uh, originally made from strands of silver? Well, tinsel. Tinsel. Okay. Uh, what's the name for the main villain in The Nightmare Before Christmas? Oh, there's another one I haven't watched. It's, um, um, it's like the pumpkin head guy, right? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Wow. Okay. It's it's oogie boogie. Okay. <laughs> okay. And then this one isn't a question. This is a, as Sandy from Left is Right Crochet would say, your who cares file. <clears throat> Santa Claus did not always dress up in red clothes. Santa Claus initially wore clothes that were in green purple, or blue. For many years, this was a common theme for the jolly old man at the North Pole. However, and you probably know this part, Coca-Cola decided to dress him up in clothes that matched their brand. And that stuck. So this is why he is always in red clothes now. And I remember... I don't, well, I don't remember that far back, but I do remember uh, back in the day that there was always the Santa Claus with the Coca-Cola bottle. They still have that, don't they? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So back in the old days, like you'd get those commercials of Santa, you know, with this Coca-Cola bottle and and then well, it turned... Well, they had the other Santa, the Pepsi Claus, but he didn't, uh, he didn't <laughs> last. <laughs> oh my God. And then they had the saddest Santa of all. That was the marriage clause. <laughs> <laughs> oh, geez. Here we go. That one lasted forever. <laughs> okay, guys. So there you have it. I guess it's my it's the end of the road for me for Blissmas. Um, so I thank you guys so much for watching. Um, don't forget, on the 25th, I start my gifts with um, Billy the Crafty Floridian. And, uh, there will be 25 of them. Right? No, th that's the 12 days of Christmas. Oh, there's 12. Yeah, so it goes till January something. Well, the way things are going, maybe there'll only be seven. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, it seems like every year that I've so far that I've been doing this, there's been a mishap of some some sort. Last year, Sandy's gifts didn't get to me, and uh, you know I had to wait till January to open them, and then they didn't show up till January until the first week of January. So it, it maybe I should just not be doing this every year because it seems to be there's always a mishap. <laughs> So, yes, um, yeah, okay, so Merry Christmas, everybody, and um, I hope that you guys stay safe, and um, yeah, hope you all have your Christmas shopping finished, and I hope the weather is playing nice, because it hasn't been <laughs> for a lot of people, and uh, I guess I will see you guys on the 25th, all right? I love you all. Talk to you later. Bye.